Hello and welcome to Crew Mode Match. My name is Greg, and today we're going to be taking a look around this Volkswagen Tiguan. It's the Evo SE Nav, and it's the 1.5 petrol edition. This vehicle does come finished in a gorgeous blue colour, which is further complemented by the chrome roof rails and the chrome window surrounds, and also the very standout Tiguan design at the rear. The boot space is plentiful as you would imagine for a car of this size, enough space there for a set of golf clubs, your weekly shopping or just some suitcases for a weekend away. Your rear passengers will enjoy the quilted two-tone fabric seat with the fabric centre armrest and two cup holders, there's even ice fix points perfect for the child seat fixings and rear air vents should you need them. Which leads on to the front interior which is a lovely place to be I must say so myself. The seats are again two-tone quilted fabric which are very comfortable and supported given that they do come with lumbar support and easily manoeuvrable. The driver is the lucky one that gets to use the multifunctional leather wrapped steering wheel with controls for the multimedia functions and the digital dash up ahead and controls for the volume controls on the left hand side. Up front like I did say you do have that digital screen which has every view that you could need for a driver such as your driving data and also your multimedia functions. But if it's entertainment that you're after then look no further than the digital touchscreen infotainment system which houses a wide range of applications such as your DAB radio but if that's not to your music taste you can connect your phone via the Bluetooth connectivity and also ensuring that you don't get lost on unknown roads is the satellite navigation but for ease of viewing you can connect your phone via the Apple CarPlay and Android Auto so it's like using your phone well on the go. Lower down you do have your dual zone climate control which does save on a lot of arguments between the passenger and the driver as everyone can be at their preferred temperature. It's also very neatly laid out with the dials so there's no need to faff with touchscreen for that one. Just in your centre console you do have storage compartments with USB ports, you've got your manual transmission and also just below that you do have the parking sensor button which does alleviate any parking worries that you would have with a car of this size as it does have front and rear parking sensors. Further down the centre console you do have a neatly designed storage compartment with two cup holders. 